This is my new chest rig from Atlas 46. And I'm using it to replace uh, tool belt, apron, and all of the other things I've tried to, to hold these tools. Problem with the tool belt usually is that it will, when it's hanging off to the side, and that's probably me, but I'm usually running into cabinets and other things because we got small spaces in the shop. So I wanted to try this out because it's mounted to the chest. You can adjust it for comfort and it holds a good amount of tools. So let me go through some of the tools that I have on here. First thing, obviously, is the tape measure. You use that, that's probably the most used tool. And I added a couple of accessories from the holstery, including this tape measure clip, because I was worried that, you know, the amount of times I use it, take it on, put it on, put it on and take it off, it would wear out these canvas straps. So I put this uh, belt clip style holster on there and it's got a nice steel clip on it. The other thing from the holstery is this big magnet. And I use that to hold tools like the screwdriver when I'm using them because it'll slap on there and it's easy to take on or put on and take off. And if, I'm, if I have a bunch of screws, I can put them on the magnet and have them easy to reach. So that's, uh, that's, that's handy. Or in this pocket, I've got my woodpecker square, six inch square that has the edge guide that I use for measuring and marking along boards. And I also use it for setting up things like my table saw. If you notice, I've got this bungee cord. I use that to strap things down when they're in there. The only thing that I found uh, about, about or an issue with this is that when I bend over, if this isn't fastened down, it can slide out. So I just grab the bungee cord. And it also keeps what's behind it, which is this caliper, another thing that I use on a regular basis. I use it with the CNC to get the very accurate measurements for depths and thicknesses of boards to make sure they're properly set up. All of my marking tools, so pencils, pens, I have a punch all for starter holes, marking holes for, for drilling, uh, Sharpie, and I have a box blade when I need something really sharp for cutting vinyl and tape and things like that. I have a work light that's just clipped on here. It has a bright and a dim mode along with a flashing, I guess an emergency mode for that. If you notice on the sides, you've got these little zippers with the, with the straps. And what that's for is this compartment that you can put things in. It's a pocket. And I have my other square, which is from Chapel Square. It's a three by four square that I use for flat surfaces and also for setting up tools to make sure things are, are square and straight. So we'll put that back in. Oh, these uh, Velcro straps. I attached some Velcro strips to this box blade and some other things that I, I want to attach and I can just pop them onto the Velcro strap. So it's kind of like the magnet. If it's not a magnet, because well, I guess that would work too, since it is magnetic. But if it is a magnetic, you can stick a Velcro strap on it. But the other tool that I have is this adjustable wrench that I discovered. It's made by a company called Nipex or Knipex, if I'm saying that right but it's an adjustable wrench that has this button that you can, I'm gonna try to do this with one hand, but let me push it down here. You can adjust it to about that size to get at any nut or bolt. It's nice and compact, it makes it really versatile. Overall though, it's been working out really well and I'm liking it. It's been comfortable. I've managed to use it every day in the shop. We'll see how it works over time. I will let you know.